welcome back to my channel, Lumen Moon Tarot. So everybody, I'm kicking up my feet and we're going to get started on just a random all signs read, okay? This reading is for the collective. It's not going to resonate with all of you. So please just take what does resonate and leave what doesn't, okay? Um, and thank you to everyone for your likes, subscribes, comments, shares, donations. Really, it's all about your kindness, man. Thank you so much. If you like this video, please click that like button. You have no idea how much it helps us readers here on YouTube just to get a, the like, you know. Um, it's, it's a big show of kindness and support, and we really do appreciate it, okay? And um, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. You're going to love it here. You're going to love it. Okay, let's cut the deck and we'll see what we've got. What are the energies? Oh, somebody's uh, fighting, battling. There could be some competition here. Somebody's watching competition come in. And I feel like they're really worried about this. You know, because this could be um, some passion here. They're thinking about this. Yeah, putting a... <laughs> this person's... Yeah... They, I feel like they're watching some competition come in here and they're not really liking it very much because um, they want this love with you. They're like praying that they're getting ready to talk. See how this page of swords is holding up their sword? This is somebody who watches, watches, right? But now this person's getting ready to talk. They don't want you with anybody else. They don't, all right? They don't like the thought of that at all, <laughs> especially if you were to be intimate with someone else. This person's um, jealous, but really it's more worry than jealousy, okay? Um, they're very, very worried, praying that this communication goes well. I feel like this person put you in a third-party situation, and I feel like you they have competition now. You may have found someone new that you're... Um, possibly sharing some passion with here and this person you know this is borderline heartbreak but also borderline oh my gosh please let this go well because I really want this love yeah because they see you as the world yeah I feel like this person is feeling very defensive here and it's I it's because there's I feel like new people coming into the picture yeah, and you're out there showing yourself. Um, you could even be in the public eye with the world here. You're absolutely amazing, stunning, uh, stepping into a lot of abundance, and you do have a lot of eyes on you. This person's really worried. Uh, with as sexy as you are in this picture, honestly, they're really worried about someone else getting with you, okay, and being intimate with you. They don't want that. They're praying that that doesn't happen because you're everything to this person. And they want this new beginning in love with you. Yeah, they're getting ready to talk. They're thinking, thinking, thinking about what they're going to say, how they're going to say it. Praying that it goes really well. Wow. Whether you have a new person or not, I feel like this person's coming in. Because they don't want you to be with anyone else. You know, you stand out above everyone else. They know they're not going to find another you. They're no, they know they're not going to find another love like this. Like, you are their one. Standing in your strength and power on the bottom of the deck here. You've got boundaries. You're very, very balanced, very intuitive, and ready to be very abundant in this new cycle. This person's really worried about new people coming in. I want to just cut it again. I don't know why. Party, celebration. You could be celebrating with friends, going out. Oh, man, this person doesn't like that at all. They don't like the thought of that. Yeah, there may be two people involved here. You, your, your person and someone else. Um, yeah, to big tower moment. Someone else is entering into the scene. Your person feels like a fool. 
They feel like a fool. Yeah, that's the truth. You've got someone else, I feel, maybe coming in to make you an offer or someone you're already being intimate with. And um, I feel like this is someone who had you trapped in your mind for a long time, a long time. And you got untrapped and healed yourself and now you're this person's wish. You're you're a star. You, I feel like you're in the public eye here. You you could even be a healer. You're pouring this healing energy back into the world. So, and you're sexy. You're really sexy. Look, um, I, I this this is really bugging this person because you're out here in the public eye showing skin. Okay. If you're not with someone already, they know it's only a very short matter of time here. But I feel like you're you are putting yourself out there, showing your abilities, you're high vibing, very peaceful, very calm. But they had you trapped in your mind about about all of this. Yeah, very intuitive. You could even be another tarot card reader. You could be, and you're entering into a new cycle. Maybe you just started a channel on YouTube, because I see you being in the public eye with your intuition here, showing your abilities, healing others, yeah. And this person is watching you too. They're watching you be absolutely stunning stunning and they've been afraid to approach you I feel because this person they haven't been wanting to confront the crappy ways that they treated you in the past right that got you trapped in your mind here yeah but now it's almost like geez you know they're saying do I want to approach do I want to talk about all this they're gonna have to I feel like this person can't move forward until they complete the cycle period and a story they've gated themselves in with all of the crappy things that they've done the poor choices they've made whatever it is right and in order to move forward they need to confront this they need to uh, talk about their behavior here and I feel like they're they're kinda getting a push to do that um, in watching you move forward and and sharing intimacy with someone else that's teaching your person a lesson for standing here doing absolutely nothing to fix this you know I feel like the divine is making them sit there and learn a lesson for not wanting to take responsibility for their actions in the past you're moving forward you're connected to the divine I feel like you've been led this whole time you know but now it's your person's turn to learn a lesson here and uh, they may even the divine may even be holding this person back a little bit until you know because they it's not like they can get away with these things right that's sort of what the divine is saying here you can't you can't really get away with this you're going to have to build up the strength to come forward. Yeah. So I feel like this person is held back until they learn their lessons. You know, and meanwhile, I feel like you're entering into a party celebration, celebrating your life, celebrating your abundance, celebrating your abilities and the ability to heal others. And your person has to watch and learn a lesson from this as you celebrate your life and live your life. Oh, They really don't want you sharing passion with anyone else, but um, I have a feeling like new love is, is either here or coming. Yeah, it's approaching you. Here it is. I feel like new love is coming in. I do. And it's a soulmate, someone who's going to approach you the right way, I feel. 
Yeah, they're seeing, yeah, it could be a Leo that approaches you, but um, they're seeing how strong you are, your high vibes, it's your energy, this person, it's your energy. And it's going to be like, not codependent, but symbiotic, you know what I mean? Yeah, and your person... They're going to be in stagnancy, always knowing that it's you that they want. And their ship's not able to come in unless, until they take responsibility and confront the, the things that they've done, their behavior. Yeah, that's what I'm getting here in this one. Let's see what your person has to say to you, okay? What does this person have to say to the person watching? Sorry, guys. It's a teeny tiny little handmade deck, okay? But I love this little deck. And I know you guys like it too. All right. All right, I wish we could forgive and forget. Yeah, because they really, this is kind of like, you know, they don't want to talk about this. They don't want to confront the things that they've done in the past. They just want to kind of get over them and start over, get back together, something. But yeah, they, they haven't been wanting to confront the situation, so they do wish they could that you could forgive and forget. They are in love with you. I am so in love with you. And you are always on my mind. Yeah, you could be dealing with um, a Sagittarius, an Aries, Aquarius, Scorpio. You could be an Aquarius as well here. Any sign, really. Um, Taurus, Aries. And I feel like a possible Leo could be coming towards you. Yeah, here's competition and here they are. Corners of the deck. Your person is praying over a third party situation and not wanting to confront the things that they've dealt with in the past. And the divine is hearing what they're saying but making them learn a lesson. Everything's lining up. I do think you have new love coming in. Your person's also in love with you. And uh, they're constantly thinking about you. Anyway, person watching, that's what I got for this little ditty. Um, if you like this reading, please go ahead, click that like button, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, right? Um, we'd love to have you here. We would love to have you here. And um, until next time, take care of you, person watching, and peace out.